So we got the bird out of the brine. We drained it all, rinsed it really, really well. You want to get all those little bits and pieces out of it. That way they don't stay in there the whole time. Uh, now what we're going to go ahead and do, we have it in the roasting pan. And to make sure it stays extra moist, we're going to actually separate the skin from the actual meat. And you want to just take your hand and very gently push it and separate the skin from the actual meat of the breast. And I'll show you why we're going to do that in just a second. So now I've made a nice pocket in there. Okay, I'm going to do the same with the other side. And you want to be careful because if you separate this connective tissue that's right there in the middle, the whole thing just falls off like a big flap and you don't want that. You want the, the skin to stay on there. You just want to make sure you make a couple of pockets on both sides. And Push it with your hand. Okay. So now that we have those pockets on both sides, and this is really good for flavoring the meat, what I'm going to do is take a big old handful of whipped butter with a lot of seasonings in it, garlic, rosemary, thyme, and you're going to shove that and just rub that right into the actual meat. Now a lot of people rub butter on the outside of the turkey, and we're going to do that too, but the butter on the outside doesn't get to the meat of it. It just gets to the skin of it. So we want, you want a tasty skin, but you also want the meat itself to be tasty. And so this is going to make it super moist and extra yummy. So again, just take that butter, put it in, and just push it all the way back right into that meat. There you go. And really push it in. You, and you'll see it through the skin. Make sure that it's pushed all the way in. Keep that part of the turkey really yummy. All right. And once that's done, you want to take the remaining amount of butter, of course, <coughs> and rub the whole outside of the turkey down with it. Rub a dub dub. This does a couple things. It actually makes sure that the turkey, of course, tastes good the skin, but the juices that are running off of it into the pan are going to be absolutely amazing because of this butter in it. So we're going to tuck those legs in now, make the turkey look proper and respectable, and get ready to put this thing in the fire. So we're going to go light the fire right now, and then we're going to go ahead and get ready to uh, let this bird get smoked. Smoking. All right. Thanks very much.